Here, I'm gonna do a thing. I wanna see if I can start the game. Because it says I can play it. Play Icarus. DX11 or play DX12 RTX 2070 or better. I don't know anything about D DirectX. Should I be playing on... Should I go for DX12? 12 is a higher number than 11. So... Connected. Okay. First things first, let's turn the audio down. Um, so we are gonna try playing Icarus today. Bob was supposed to be at a, at, at, uh, unavailable. Uh, apparently he's gonna be actually streaming tonight. But we still, I made plans with Moses. So, uh, our default fob is on 80, but I'll probably just leave that. I'm gonna turn my sensitivity down to like 0.4. Full screen, please. Wait, RTX enabled. Okay, I'm not gonna turn that on until we see how the game performs. If it performs fine, I'll turn it on. But uh, this game looks pretty good, I'm pretty sure. So, we'll just leave it for now. Did it fully release? Yeah, it comes came out five minutes ago. Is this a battle royale? No, it's a it's a survival game. All right, so we'll just uh, we'll just play some, and Moses will show up at some point. So I really, I honestly don't know much about this game other than that it's a survival game, and that I'm pretty sure one of the lead developers on this is the creator of DayZ. So it's supposed to be good. Confirm character. My character is boring looking. That's fine. Home. Okay, looks like we can start it. Okay, play the game. Open a new contract. So I think this is going to be some kind of game where you can play like... You do like a uh, session. And then you can do another session where you do something else. And it's like a different story, basically. You're, you're surviving on a different planet or a different area or something. You start from scratch again. So I guess we'll just go to new prospect. Oh! So this is what I was talking about. How do I right click? Okay. Okay, very cool. So I'm pretty sure we unlock these. So like this is where we start. And then we start unlocking more missions. Okay, this is really cool actually. One thing I don't love about a lot of survival games is how open ended they are, but this seems like you have missions, there's stuff to do, you win, and possibly there's a thing at the very end. This is coming soon the heck so this says beachhead recon uh, mandated first drop for new prospectors okay welcome to icarus friend. thank you thank you uda says we gotta drop you in a safe well-mapped zone your first time down fine they must have been thinking of some other planet <laughs> you'll see for yourself soon enough okay there's a ways to go before you head out hunting for exotics. Right now, it's about learning to survive on the surface. So head down, How hard could it be? Take a look around, then we'll talk. Okay. Sounds easy enough. Select an enviro suit and load equipment onto your dropship for your next mission. Okay. Confirm. Lobby settings, friends only. Okay. Okay. What are the system requirements? I have no idea. Just look it up on Steam and I'll have the system requirements. Yeah, I I, 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 I didn't turn RTX on yet. I want to see how it performs first. I have my FPS counter turned on. You guys can't see it, but... Um, if it performs well, then I'm going to turn RTX on see how it looks, but... Okay, this is fine. We're okay. We're okay, right? Hello? Hello? <laughs> I think our burnt... Our, I think we're okay. I think we're landing. Oh, there's a window. I didn't realize this was a window. Wait. They sent me somewhere snowy? Okay, the performance is really bad. I'm getting 20 Welcome FPS. Icarus, oh, now I'm getting 70. The air is poison. And the weather's like nothing you've ever seen. You'll need to make yourself some shelter soon enough. But you know what you're doing, right? Oh yeah, I know That's what I'm doing. That's why you came all the way out here. I got many. With nothing, cause you could. Well, UDA wants you to show you understand the basics. 
before they send you anywhere really dangerous. So get acquainted, then head back up when you're ready. Okay. Good luck, friend. Thanks, man, but I don't need luck. Okay, so it looks like we have some... Can you guys see that on the left? You can. It's right above my camera. Cool. Um, so yeah, the game is running fine. It was running really bad for a second. It doesn't run well. Um, I'm getting 60 frames, 70 frames. So I might turn some stuff down. For the stream, the stream can't display more than 60 FPS. So if it's not traveling below 60, I might just keep it this way. Okay, so our, our goals. We have goals. We have objectives. Hunt, gather, craft. All your actions grant experience to so level up for access to new skills and blueprints. Build a shelter and craft a bedroll to survive the harsh Icarus environment. Okay. That sounds easy. Here's a stick. Harvest. Okay, I'm getting XP for harvesting this. Can I harvest this? Yes. I'm just picking up sticks. This is e this is easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Shouldn't I be holding a rock? No, no, no. Looks like we have temperature on the bottom left. Oxygen, hunger, thirst, health. What else do we have? Mission timer. We have six days, 23 hours. Okay, so like this, you can't harvest. You need an axe or something. Oh, never mind. Apparently I'm very strong. Interesting. Oh, this planet is not uh, very big. I've got... I'm jumping. Low gravity. Oxide deposit. Oh. I like how you can just smash all the plants. Okay, so how do we like, uh, what do we need to do? We need to build a shelter and craft a bedroll. What does tab do? Okay. Crafting. Oh, apparently I have a stone pickaxe. Or wait, no, these are recipes. Okay, so these are the recipes that I know. So these just require fiber, stick, and stone. So we'll make these. Craft. Cool. Craft. Alright, what else can we make? A wood pile? Are there more tabs here? This is everything, I think. So how to make a bedroll, I wonder. Interesting. Okay. Can I smash this stuff? Oh my god. I'm getting stone. I like how it's, um... It's like voxel based. Which is cool. Oh, the crouching is, is really is something else. This is the crouching. <laughs> it's just an insta. No enemy. Oh! You can play a TPP. I like how it's. Yeah, this is like kind of voxel y. Like I'm smashing away at this rock. Okay, I don't really know if I need stone right now, so I probably should stop collecting this. It's actually kind of satisfying to smash this. Okay, something's happening. Oh, I'm running out of stamina. Okay. I got a stamina bar in the middle. And there, it looks like there is durability. Unlucky. <laughs> I despise dur Oh my god, hello? I need to eat you for my... Well, I don't necessarily need to eat you. I just need to... I need to hunt you. Come here. Come here. Hey. Oh my. Did I kill it? Where'd it go? Hello? Good work, Freshwood. Oh, thank you. What happened? I leveled up. What you do with that knowledge, well, oh, here it is. That's up to you. Rabbit carcass. No point picking up a hammer if you don't know what you're making. Before you build, you gotta learn how. Here's some lilies. Those seem not very useful. Uh, there's another kind of like stone or something over here. Uh. Wait, I thought it. Here it is.
Yeah, I just hate I hate repairing in any survival game. I I hate it. I don't know. That's okay though. I mean, this thing is really easy to craft, so you just make more of them. But like, if it's really easy to craft and you make more of them, then like, why is there durability? <laughs> no. Okay. Um. I mean, I can make a wood pile. I don't know if I should. Okay, what we also have this. Oh, here we go. Here's how we get the bedroll. We have a talent tree. Oh my god. Holy crap. There's a talent tree and a tech tree. I don't know there's I don't know there's talents. So, do I have any points? Manny said be careful with your points, but what does he know? <laughs> Increases wood from felling. This is like harvesting stuff. Increases base health. Increases base movement speed. Increases meat yield. Slows food decay in your inventory. Oh. Planted crops grow faster. Okay. So we probably want to try to specialize in one of these things. I like to, when I'm looking at these, like to look at the bottom, actually, and see what, like... Chance to instantly chop a tree... Chance to mine a deposit in one hit. Okay. So this whole, this is all lumber and this is all mining. Although it looks like the two trees are connected. I know you guys can't see some of it because of my camera, but. Uh, well, no, they're not connected, actually. Um, what's down here? There are more trees. Look at the top. Oh. There's like 10 skill trees. How am I supposed to choose? <laughs> solo. Is this only if you're playing solo? This talent tree only functions when playing solo. Okay, so I'm not going to do that. Pistol handling. <laughs> okay, there's a combat tree, a construction tree, and a survival tree. Oh my god. Okay, just forget it for right now. We'll just save that point. All right, what about the tech tree? So one of the things I need to do is craft this bedroll right here. So I have three... Oh, I have three points available. So I can go to campfire, bedroll. Oh, I can craft a fire whacker. <laughs> okay. Uh, I can do the fire pit, but that requires level five. I can also make a spear. That seems pretty good. And a knife, probably for skinning. Okay, we'll go for the spear, I guess. Oh wait, does it just you click it and that's how you level it? Okay, be careful with your points, because you don't. There's no like. There's no, oh wait, there's two. Okay, uh, this isn't as complicated, I don't think, because you probably just unlock most of this stuff. Holy crap! There's a lot of stuff. Oh my god. Okay. This game's got a lot of stuff. Which I was just talking about the other day is I like that a lot. Okay, so let's craft this wooden spear. And uh, let's craft this campfire. Now, what do we need for a bedroll? We need 20 fur and 10 leather. So, we're probably going to have to level up some more and get uh, that, that knife so we can carve up some leather. Uh, I have this carcass. Can I do something with this? The only bad thing about the game so far is the crouching. <laughs> like, there's no animation. <laughs> you just suddenly crouch. It's a little weird. Uh, reed flowers. I can just keep harvesting stuff. I don't know how much inventory space I have. Because I'm getting XP for this. Kind of want to murder something, though. 
I don't think I can murder this. I think it's probably too fast. Can I swim? I can swim. I'm getting cold, though. Hey, come here. Hey. Hey. Oh my god. He's a jumper. We got a jumper. Where'd he go? Hey. Okay, dude. There's a fob slider. Yeah, I was thinking about changing the fob. I have it on the default right now, but I think it's fine. Is this the same one I was hitting? Oh, wait, that's something big and scary. Excuse me. Are you... Oh, okay, that thing I'm not going to attack. Okay. Well, this doesn't really help me, huh? What do I need again? Fur. Yeah, I need that knife. So... This is too big to pick up, I guess. So we're just going to have to... Yeah, it says we need the knife. Okay. Well, we just need to level up then, I assume. Because I need to get this... What do I need? Oh, I need this this knife. Stone knife. So I guess I'm just going to like chop some trees or something. I don't know. Also, I don't know if I should really be near my... Uh, drop pot or not. It might not matter, but this seems like a good place to be. There's water. You can scroll down in the tech tree. Or can you scroll down? No, it's, it's just horizontal. I also mine this. Just giving me a tiny bit of experience. I'm, I'm carrying the rabbit. Yeah, I'm carrying it. Stamina. Another thing that seems kind of unnecessary, but since we can level up and stuff, maybe there's some stuff to help us with that if we want to. Stamina, I think, works well for combat, but when it comes to, like, mining this rock, like, uh, just let me smack it. Moses will spawn at the drop pod. Oh, okay, good point. Okay. There's fish. Can I spear this fish? Hmm. Uh, I've just noticed that my, uh... Apparently I can drink this. Uh, should I drink this? Yep. I just noticed that my oxygen meter in the bottom left is kind of going down. How the heck do I get more oxygen? And can I just say, it sure doesn't seem like this environment is toxic like they said. But... The blue rocks. There, it's just called oxide, right? So, perhaps? Oh yeah, it says plus nine oxygen when consumed. How do I consume it? Consume. I'm just gonna eat these rocks. Damn, these are delicious. Consume stack. Okay, nice. Now I just need to eat some food, which I don't have yet, but that's okay. Let's see what chopping a tree is like. I'm gonna chop a tree. How bad is this on stream chat? I bet it's really grainy. Oh, watch out. Okay. Okay, so I guess you just chop it down into small enough pieces that you can pick up. It's clear on your end. Yeah. Is it, though? I bet my camera gets really pixely. Like, this game has so much foliage and stuff. Like, it's insane. It looks great, though. Why 
does this highlight? Can I press F on this? Oh, dropship interface. Okay, I can store stuff here. Okay, that's good to know. Oh, hello. Okay, hello, wolf. You want to fight me? Don't mess with me. I'm, I'm fine here. I get wrecked. I think he hit me, though. A little bit. Oh, yeah, I lost some health. Oh, my God, I lost a ton of health. I lost, like... What was that noise? Uh, I don't have the... I need... Man, I really need to level up so I can get this. Oh, I'm almost leveled up. Okay, let's just chop down another tree and I think I'll level up. Timber! Whoa! Oh. Spade, thanks for the resub. 35 months. Thank you, dude. Oh my god. Okay, I have leveled up, so I should get like three more tech tree points. Okay, so let's just go to the stone knife first, and then I'm not going to put anything. I can get a bandage, a bow. Oh, we can get a bow. Wooden repair hammer. Armor. Oh, and then we can make... Oh, then we unlock, like, building stuff. Walls and windows. Ooh la la. Okay. How do I get to the tier? Oh, this requires level... Okay, once I get level 10, 20, and 30, that's when the extra tiers unlock. Very cool. Okay. So we want to craft this uh, knife here. Perfect. Okay. Oh god, not again. Hey. I didn't do I didn't do it. Wait, no, hey, that's mine. I didn't do it, but it's mine. Stay away. Should've listened. Okay. Hold the skin. I think I hear another one. Uh-oh. I think it... Okay, this is a bummer. Bad dog. My spear broke. Oh, God. Craft another one. So, like, what do I do with this broken spear? Can I just destroy it? Destroy. Oh, what a great feature. I love it. Just... <laughs> I hate when you play a game, like survival games especially, where you can't just delete something. Because then you just have a pot, you end up with piles of just stuff everywhere. I could have repaired it. Yeah, that's okay. Because I, uh, okay, I skinned this. And now I can harvest it. Oh, now I get all this stuff. Leather, fur, bone, and raw meat. Oh, and then it left behind, okay. It says 70% decay. Can I not take the bones? Oh, I'm getting bones. Okay. Thank you, Wolf. I used every part. All right. I'm pretty sure this is on PC only, right? I wonder how the controller support is. Because I think I should tell Carrie about this, because I think she would really, really enjoy this. My knife is almost broken. Oh my god. I I hate that, man. But whatever. We get, like, What does it even take to make? It takes... Two fiber, two sticks, and four stone. Yeah, so it basically costs nothing. So again, like, it probably doesn't matter. And I'm not trying to complain, but I just, it's just a pet peeve of mine in games like this, survival games, where it's like, this costs nothing, and then it just breaks. Like, this reminds me of uh, one game that it really made me frustrated in was Breath Edge. I would have to, like, everything would break so fast, and you'd have to craft over and over. It was so tedious. It was just tedious. Okay, how much, um,. We need more fur. We have 16 out of 20 fur. 
Okay, I don't want to try to mess with that. I think that thing's going to kill me. Because getting hit once by the wolf took me took like 30, 30 HP or so. Yeah, like I'm sure once I get better gear, then it won't break as fast. Ooh, what is this? Pumpkins? Wait, it is pumpkins. How are there pumpkins, but not oxygen? <laughs> Hello? Alright, we just gotta find another wolf or something. I have the rabbit. Uh, how do I put this down? It says left click to place, but I can't. Oh, drop. Here we go. Hey, little buddy. Oops, oops. Wrong button. Okay. Thank you. And I still don't have enough. That, oh, that didn't give me any fur. Okay, so we're going to have to find another... Uh, and my knife is broken. Can I somehow repair this? I can. It costs one... Okay, that's fantastic. I take back everything I said. I take back everything I said. Everything I said was wrong. It costs like one stone to repair it. Which also doesn't really make that much sense. But that's fine. If I can repair easily, I'm a happy camper. My O2 is very low. Uh, what? It's fine. My hunger is low, but I'll eat something in a second. I've got all this meat to eat. Oh, I could probably eat these berries. Maybe. Am I allowed to, like, tell whether or not these are edible? Berries will satisfy hunger, hydrate slightly, and... Okay, I'm just gonna eat these. Nom nom. I hear scary sounds. I don't want scary sounds. I just want another wolf. There's one. Now, I've noticed that when I crouch, I do get a little... It's kind of hard to see, but it says I'm getting stealthy. Oh, this game is ruining my uh, OBS. I'm getting 30 FPS in OBS right now. Okay, I'm going to have to try to fix that chat. That's not good. What's well, a little too? Oh, <laughs> what's up, dude? I might be able to fix that. Uh, hopefully I can. Some games have been doing this lately to my OBS. Wait, storm incoming. Shower. Minor showers are approaching. Oh, okay, that's fine. We hear another... Wo Whoa, hey! Maybe... Yeah, I'm gonna try to cap my FPS. I mean, like, the thing is... Yeah, I'm gonna try that. I'm going to try to get back to my pod real quick. Because that's what happened in Halo. I had to cap my FPS and it fixed the problem. So let me see if I can do that. Settings. Uh, frame limit. Let's turn this to like... For Halo, I did 120 and it worked. No, it's not fixing it. Uh. Ooh, the rain is nice. Let's try capping at 60 FPS. This is going to be painful, but... Nope, I'm still getting a third... Oh, there we go. Okay, that did it. Okay, I'll just play in 60 FPS right now. It should be a lot smoother on stream right now. Okay, sorry about that, chat. All is fixed now. Okay, so... Now we can make this bed roll. Um, the problem is, it's raining, so I guess I'll, wh whatever, I'm just going to craft it. Probably go into my bag, right? Yeah. Mission complete. Okay. Now it says mission complete. What do I do now? Do I leave? Return to station. I guess so. Returning to orbit will settle your claim to this drop and delete all items you are currently carrying. Oh, really? Rewards will be calculated once everyone leaves. Okay. 
taking my spear with me. Okay, faction missions complete. Objectives, recon, forest zone. Wait, did I do my... What is that? Completed? I'm confused. Okay, got a bunch of accolades here. Okay, I guess that was just like the little tutorial mission. I'm in the character selection screen. Select character. Okay, so now I guess we have another one unlocked. Okay, cool. Terrain scan. Gather terrain data for new drop zones. Okay. Welcome back. Lagos unit runs Icarus for the UDA. But most of this planet's still a blank on the map. The okay. unit wants new drop zones, which means getting terrain scans. And they'll pay for the privilege. Just set up a radar at three locations and come back alive. Sounds easy you enough. For it? I'm up for it. First, I gotta send a text. Hi, YouTube. Thanks for watching my videos, YouTube. I love you.